It's a long-time rivalry that has seen 88 previous battles. Tonight, James Madison University travels to Fairfax, Virginia to take on the Patriots of George Mason University. Essex finds Curry who rattles down another three-pointer. James Mason now listens to you, Ron, and takes advantage of no Devon Moore, possibly for the final 430 of this half. Curry has to step in and play big right now. He <laughs> has from offensive range three three-pointers for freshman Ron Curry. JMU now is done as freshman Curry leading all their scores with 11 points. And the Dukes turn it over. That pressure is felt. Okaloji hammers it and picks up a foul. Five to shoot for Devon Moore. Another shake and bake move. Quick pass and the flush from Enoch Hood. And he's had a lot going on in his life. That's why I can't be happier for him and the success he's had. His mom right now is suffering from brain cancer. Now we see why Gujanicic, with his four fouls, is back in the lineup for Paul Hewitt. I'm telling A tie ball game at 50 all. Gujanicic is feeling the three-point line and got another. He can shoot it out. He can shoot it. He can basket, but he must because he's a definitely, he definitely, definitely can shoot from that range. He's a 26% free or three-point shooter. They turn it over again, and Brian Allen, who has been a big factor for Mason in this second half, has got the Patriots back on top. This time, their largest by five. Allen, Matt Brady has told his troops to back it off. He's telling them to, but. <laughs> I don't think they've listened right now. Now they finally got the message. As they're going to let George Mason finish out this contest. And now JMU will fall to George Mason for the eighth time in a row. The 18th time in the last 19 games. As the Patriots right the ship here at home after falling over the weekend to UNC Wilmington. An impressive second half for Paul Hewitt's squad as they come away now with a 68-57 win.